what a delight, what a thrill in the sunshine. It is the big boys crew. Yay! The big boys. The big boys. And welcome to the red carpet. Thanks, mate. Well, thanks for having us. Yeah. Is it surreal, all three of you guys? I mean, look, it's not just yeah. you three, the whole gang's here. Yeah. How surreal is it gang. to be here for the show that you've loved making so much? I mean, it's so like we're all trying not to have a little teary moment because we've all had our makeup done. So it's <laughs> oh, we can't have that running. We can't have that, but I mean, it's brilliant. And we're, we're filming series two at the moment, yeah. so we are spending all we're the time exhausted. together. <laughs> we yeah. went to the BAFTA Vogue party the other day in one of the transit production crew vans and turned up like as Edward Enifal was getting out and we were in an eight seater transit. But look, that, that's how the big boys roll, you know? That's how the big boys roll. I mean, let's go through these nominations, shall we? Okay, three nominations. For TV craft, writer, comedy, emergent talent fiction. Yeah. And out of all three of those, uh, what would make your heart sing the most to win? Do you know what? Like, I obviously want the show to win. And, and, I, and I, you know, I, but I also am conscious we have a Derry Girl with us. And the <laughs> Derry Girls finale I loved. But the fourth nomination we have is John. Yeah, yeah. And it would mean, that almost would mean the world to me. There would not be a Big Boys without. John because I needed to trust somebody to play a character like Danny and play the comedy and the drama and he's phenomenal and like he's also you know they're everyone's all of my actual best mates so fingers crossed for John fingers crossed for big boys yeah. Yeah. we want a hat trick we want yeah. We, yeah, yeah exactly exactly I mean there is so much love that has come uh, for the show it was made with with so much love Look, um, how does it feel, sort of looking at Jack every day, working at Jack well, every I day? Mean, <laughs> <laughs> no, Jack. Hang on, I ain't finished. I ain't finished. But look, you know, you you are essentially being him. Um, has this yeah. been like the ultimate case study for an actor to take on this role? Definitely, it's been <laughs> yeah. so fun. I, and I'm I'm planning to go to uh, him and his mum's to oh, stay yeah. the night. Little little sleepover. Because we film away. we film in Watford, so Dylan's yeah. just going to come stay with me and my mum for a couple of nights. Some homework, you know. Yeah. yeah. Method. <laughs> exactly. Yeah. I'm here for it. Yeah. Um, John, talk to me about how much um, doing this show has um, changed your life and actually changed your relationship with these two fine young men. Well, this yeah, obviously these two like getting to be with these two all the time is is the best. But I don't know. This is the first time I feel like with a job I've been able to like really get into my stride. And Jack, when I met Jack, I think he kind of. Oh, that sounds cheesy as hell, but like saw me for like what I am and like who I am. And that, you know, if you're lucky, you get that with this job. Like you get someone who, who sees that. So that's, yeah. 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 It's so nice because really you think about Big Boys, it's, that show is a comedy through and through, but it's about like the worst things that have sort of ever happened mm. to me and about grief and about mental illness and sexuality and all these things. But it never feels, these two help me make it light. Like, it's the, also the best thing that's ever happened to me. Like, <laughs> I'm gonna get like emotional, but like, we're at the f***ing BAFTA, oh, I said the F word. <laughs> it's okay, no, we're at the no, 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 we're at that's the, always be It was always gonna be me, I'm so sorry, <laughs> edit it out. <laughs> we're on the freaking BAFTAs. You're really here. And like, yeah, it's yeah, so it really cool, is. it feels very good. Sorry. No, do not apologize. Um, talk to me about, I guess, the Vim, because it seems like you've got a new Vim, you know, with the love from the from the viewers for series yes. two. Has that just put such a fire in your belly for this series to make it even better than the first? It definitely feels different this time, because we're filming it now. There's definitely an energy on set, and like, most of the crew are the same as well, so it just yeah. feels, it feels really, really special. It did, it did first time round, but you know, it's, it's the unknown at that stage, so this time it's, yeah, it's amazing, yeah. And last question. Um, now, look, I know you guys uh, like to party, as we've seen Excuse fictionally me? and in real life. Responsibly, of course. Responsibly, of course. So what's the plan uh, tonight if you take home one of those golden bad boys? Um, either way, it's, 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 it's ending the same, it's I think. Same. I actually, in the hotel this morning, woke up early to get a room upgrade. So we got a balcony. Oh. <laughs> Back to nominate his change. Yeah, yeah. I know. We were, yeah. we were like, we were going to have a good one, you know? Yeah, I mean, I've gone from being really skint to having like a tiny bit of cash. So I might as well spend that on having a good time. Yeah. Yeah. And that is a word. Uh, Dylan, John, Jack, thank you so much. Thank you. And good luck tonight. Yeah. The biggest Cheers. of boys. <laughs>